Hello everyone. Thank you for tuning in. My name is David A. Kwan and welcome to my YouTube channel. If you're a brand new visitor to my YouTube channel and have no idea what my videos are all about, I love to talk about things I'm passionate about, man. Movies, comic books, video games. I do hauls, reviews, unboxings. If that's the type of thing you're into, you may want to check out my other content. If you like what you see, do subscribe. And if you like what you see here and want to learn more about me, I have a Twitter, I have an Instagram. If you like video game related stuff, I just got Twitch. Singer's name, author out, David A. Qua. All right. I should stop saying Twitter. I keep saying Twitter, man. I actually restarted this video like two times already because I said that. It's called the X app now. Whatever. Let's continue on. I'm not going to do this again. All right. It's been a while since I've done a Saw series video. There's been like three movies out since the last time I made a video like this. Okay. Talking about the Saw franchise. And uh, man, that was a long time ago since I was, uh, since I was in college. So, so... Now that I'm, I'm, I'm out of school, graduated, found a job, got married and all that stuff, like, uh, uh, yeah, it, it's been a long time since I've talked about the Saw franchise. Let's, let's talk about it now, okay? Saw X came out. I haven't seen it yet, okay? So, um, don't, uh, don't spoil it for me. I, I have heard a few things, like, uh, it's, it's not like, like Saw X, Saw 10, it's not really like the 10th part, but it, it takes place before... Uh, in between where Saw 1 and 2 are and stuff like that. That's that how it fits into the story. Even though the actors don't look like they're, they're in their younger, you know, like it, it, Amanda and Hoffman and, and Tobin Bell returns uh, in Saw X, but apparently they, uh, uh, they look old, but they, they, uh, I, I guess I'll, I'll watch the movie. I'll see the movie, you guys will, will, will know what I'm talking about. Uh, uh, you guys will see my reaction or something uh, in, in, in the future, okay? Subscribe to see, uh, see, see that, okay? So uh, let's talk about the Saw franchise first of all, and then we'll just uh, we'll just go from there. Okay, Saw. So, I got the uncut edition here. The movie came out in two thousand four. Two thousand four. I was still in high school, man. I was still in high school. I, I remember watching this movie for the very first time too. Uh, I think because my parents had satellite, so I was watching on like uh, 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 um, like Cinemax or or HBO or Showtime or something like that. It was like I remember watching on TV. And then, it, you know, it was like these two guys, they were locked inside a bathroom, and there's apparently this, this, like, serial killer, although he's not really a serial killer, he just, like, traps his victims, uh, and puts them in, uh, have, have them play games and stuff like that, you know? So these two guys were inside the bathroom, oh, it, it's not like he's, he's uh, Jigsaw just taking some innocent people or anything like that, you know? Like, they, they're, they're a-holes, you know what I'm saying? They're like, uh, they're... They're, these are guys are like very negligent with their job. Uh, they're they're just bad people. They're cheaters or something like that. You know, like you know what I mean. So so it's not like he's just taking innocent good good people. It's like these people, you know, uh, they probably look at life badly. They're cheater people badly or whatever. And then uh, Jigsaw, uh, the Jigsaw killer, killer, um, puts them in these these situations where. They'll have a new lease on life. You know, they'll, they'll look at life a lot more differently or whatever, okay? So that was Saw. Two dudes stuck in the bathroom. One of them knows about uh, their past and this guy's cheating who and whatever, right? And they're like, well, who's going to survive? Who's going to be the one? Uh, these two bad people, who will be the uh, the one that will be uh, the better, you know? The Uncut Edition has a bunch of special features, okay? Uh... Behind the scenes stuff, featurettes, uh, these little report, uh, little uh, shorts and stuff like that. Okay, they have Jigsaw's Workshop, a build a puppet DVD ROM thing that you can put on your computer. Okay, I like how their packagings are too. Okay, Saw Two came out in two thousand five. This is which one's this? This is the one with the with the with the, all, the that whole group that was stuck inside the house, right? And uh, yeah, uh, it continues on the story about the jigsaw dude, the uh, uh, Tobin played by Tobin Bell, uh, John Kramer, right? And uh, you know th these guys are put in these situations where they uh, like, like who will survive, who will see the world differently after they're done, you know? 
We got Saw 3 here. This is the unrated edition. You haven't seen anything yet. This movie came out in 2006. Which one is this? This is the dude. This is the one with the dude that had the, uh, like, he, he had to forgive, right? Like, his, his, his son was killed in a, uh, like, a drunk driving accident. And, uh... I guess the game is like the, will, will he forgive the person who drove the car and stuff like that? Uh, Jigsaw has disappeared along with his new apprentice, Amanda. Oh, oh yeah. So another thing that you need to know about the, the Saw franchise, John Kramer, the Jigsaw killer, played by Tobin Bell. Uh, he, um, he, uh, he has cancer in, in, in the movies, right? So, um, so uh, Amanda, who is like his, his, his student, uh, kidnapped this doctor and then she was like trying to keep him alive and all that stuff um, Unfortunately, uh, well, I'm not gonna spoil it. Well, I, these movies are really old but let, 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 We know that that Jigsaw uh, actually dies uh, After this one. I thought that was done man. That's not the, the Saw trilogy. That was it, you know, and then they continued on with the story uh, 2007 so Amanda uh, kind of continues the work of, of Jigsaw, right? I wish I had the widescreen version. This is the full screen version. I love the, the box art, though. Look at that. Like, it's all clear, okay? And inside, you see an actual saw. <laughs> an intense nail biter. Look at all those DVD features, man. Like, if you buy a DVD these days, assuming you, you buy DVDs at all, um, uh, they don't have as many special features. Like, if you want the special features, you got to get the Blu-ray special edition or something like that, you know? But look at this. Audio commentaries from the director to producers, like the people who made the movie. They, 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 they uh, sit there with you and watch the movie with you and talk about, like, behind-the-scenes trivia and stuff like that. There's all, all these behind-the-scenes featurettes, deleted scenes, and all that stuff. Okay. Saw 5. Saw 5 came out in 2008. I got the unrated director's cut. I think if you watch these movies, chances are you get the uh, the, uh, the the unrated version, the director's cut, the the extended edition. You know, this one came out in two thousand eight. This one, like like they introduce other characters too. Like like Amanda, for instance, is not the only apprentice. There's this one dude, uh, Hoffman, who's like working with the police and stuff like that. He's trying to get everyone to like uh, off off the uh, like. There's so much lore, so much like 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 story going on, right? There's so many characters to keep track of. But uh, not only is Amanda a, a, an apprentice, but also this dude Hoffman. And Hoffman's trying to get all the police to like 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 he's trying to like frame this other this FBI agent and stuff like that. Okay. So there was this FBI agent also, and he's trying to like. Make ever all the police believe that 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 other dude, the FBI agent, is is the actual jigsaw killer, not him. You know, like Hoffman is like like an, an, another another student. You know, so uh, uh, John Kramer has like like mo multiple students and stuff like that, continuing his work after he died in Saw Three. Okay, and and, and throughout the entire <laughs> okay, Saw Six, Saw Six came out in two thousand nine. Once again, unrated director's cut got on Blu-ray this time. Audio commentaries, the jigsaw reveal, a killer maze, the saw uh, game over, uh, making of featurettes, okay? All these other special features. Saw 6. Two. So... It, like it, the, the story continues like like they've been all involved all along and stuff like that there's all these flashbacks going on like there, there's there's tons of, of uh, 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 story man there's so much story going on like, like I, I thought it was over after after three and then that they keep continuing the, like like oh back in and that time back back in that uh, that that uh, uh, time period like like uh, they did this you know like there was stuff going on while this movie was happening and stuff like that okay? And then happened. Uh, then the next movie that happened was was I thought the the, the, fi the final movie in the, in the franchise. Honestly, okay. Saw so, the final chapter. This came out in three D, by the way, because three D was like big back then. And then um, they, uh, they they made like a, a, a Saw three D version of it. I mean, this version doesn't have the three D in it, but uh, <laughs> it's very gimmicky. You know, a lot of stuff like running towards you, towards towards camera and stuff like that in this movie. Okay. Uh, but it came out in 2010, okay? 
Hmm? Yeah, this is one disc. Okay, there's there's the saw. Okay, look at that. Beautiful, huh? You can see through the, the, the case and stuff like that. They're putting a lot of work into this. Okay, um, in Saw 3D, because that's the name that it came out, uh, there was, oh yeah, there was, there's so much other, um, more characters to keep track of. So, uh, he was married, right? Uh, uh, John Kramer, uh, the Jigsaw Killer, um, he, he had a, 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 an ex-wife. Ex-wife's all, all, like, involved with the story also. Like, it's, it's, it's crazy. It's like, it's nuts. He has, like, the dude's dead, right? Jigsaw Killer's gone, but it's got the ex-wife. It's got Amanda. It's got Detective Hoffman. Like, there's so many people to keep track of, man. Like, like it doesn't want to add. Like, he has such a, a legacy afterwards, okay? And then, for a while, I, this is what I took with me when I, like, when these movies were done, right? Okay? I actually went back to school. I think it was like 2012, 2013 when I went back to get my master's degree in, in college. Okay, I went, I went back to college. I wanted to get another degree. And then I, I took this with me. Okay, I was like, I want to see the Ma Saw movies, but I don't want to take all these with me. I, I just want like, one package. Well, here it is. You wouldn't believe how much I spent on this too, man. It's got all the digital codes and stuff like that too. And it was like 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 $5. Maybe even less, I think. I got I found out a Goodwill or something like that. But all the movies are here. Look, so... Saw two and saw three here. Four and five there. Six and three D there. Okay. Or the final chapter. Final. <laughs> so, so uh, yeah, we thought that was it. This is the Saw franchise for a very long time. And then these happen. <laughs> like, like, this is crazy. Um, Jigsaw came out in 2017. I have not seen this movie, okay? Jigsaw, the game continues. There's uh, Tobin Bell, John Kramer with the, the doll's paint on it, okay? He'll, it'll, like, it'll come out, there'll be like a recording or something like that that tells the people like what are the rules and stuff with, with the games and whatever. Like, there's a lot going on, okay? Uh, so there's a few people here with buckets on their heads. Okay. Oh, I, I saw some clips and stuff like that. Okay. So I haven't seen the actual movie from beginning to end yet, but I've seen some, some like, it's been out for years, right? I, uh, I watched some clips, some YouTube, uh, stuff. So I, I got the, the story pretty much of what, what happened. So, um, I remember there was, uh, uh, there was, there was a scene where the girl had to choose like between three needles or something like that. Right. One of them was like the antidote to like the poison that's inside her. One of them was like acid that would burn her, and one's like, uh, one's like, like, like I, I remember, but uh, there, there was like, you had to choose between needles and stuff. I, I saw that scene, okay? But uh, Jigsaw here, let's take it out of the slipcover here. Got it on DVD, got pretty cheap too. I got all these movies, like every single one of these uh, Saw movies, like, I got have digitally too. Like on uh, Movies Anywhere and Voodoo and stuff like that. So I really don't need these DVDs or Blu-rays anymore. I'm hanging on to them just because, you know, I... Uh, I, uh, I'm a collector. I like the franchise that way. Okay. All right. And the final movie here, you can call it Saw, Saw 9 if you want, because after this, it's Saw 10, Saw X, right? So this is part of the series. It's a movie called Spyro from the Book of Saw. I haven't seen this one either. Okay. This came out. This came out. Uh, it was during COVID for sure. I remember it came out during COVID. But look at this. I waited until it went. Someone popped it up at uh, saw that two ninety nine at a Goodwill. I couldn't believe it. I, I, look at this. This is even, even more shocking. It's done the plastic. It's like brand new, man. Got got Samuel Jackson. Got got Chris there. Chris Rock. Okay. Uh, let's see what, what special features they have. Look at that. Compare to compare to something like this, right? Or maybe some of these DVDs they got less uh, less special features. Look at all, all the special features compared to uh, this one. Auto commentary, the trailer, and a couple featurettes. Hmm. I have not seen this movie. I don't know if you need to see it to understand Saw X. Wait, you know, like. I was, I've already been told that Saw X takes place between these two movies. So I guess I can watch Saw X if I want to, right? I, I, I don't have to watch uh, Spiral or uh, Jigsaw 
uh, to never stand. So, hey, I will see it. I don't know when. Okay? It's just, uh, uh, it, it, it'll happen. All right. So, um, that is the Saw Collection. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. And uh, what is your favorite Saw film? What's your favorite trap? What's your favorite character and stuff like that? Comment below, okay? Share the word about this YouTube channel, okay? Uh, spread the word about it. Let people know that I exist and stuff like that. And uh, thank you for watching. I'll do some live streams of Assassin's Creed Mirage later on today. And uh, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.